Bridges, I'd like to have a word with you. When you get a minute. Director assistance may help you. Dominic's Pizza on Robinson. Thank you. One moment, please. One moment, please. I'm sorry I shouldn't have enlisted. Well, it's there, operator. I've been there. Well, ma'am, could it be under another name? No, that's the name. Dominic's Pizza. What are you looking under? Ma'am, how are you spelling Dominic's? Well, you're supposed to know. You're sure a stupid operator. Don't they train you over there? Ma'am, um, would you like to speak with my supervisor? No, I don't want to speak to nobody else in that damn phone company. All the funds are dummies. Director Assistance, may I help you? What size bra do you wear? Santini! Bierman! Richardson! Mr. Bridges, can I have a word with you? I've got no answer for you now. I'm busy. Kelleher! Yeah, I was just uh, wondering if you'd talk to Mr. Appleby like you promised me. These men want their money, too, Richardson. Yes, sir, I understand. Sanchez? Kind of worried about my upward mobility. Miller? Yep. Creighton? Robertson? Turn in, in. I've been knocking out dents. I've been sleeping in a truck bed with a blonde and a copperhead chasing down whiskey with beer. This is hard country out here. Now stay pressed gypsies, they never roam. They live in Midland, Texas. In their mobile homes And they talk about livestock With pink cheek peacocks Who dance like bank cashiers This is our country Out here This is Hey, Royce. Too 
my brother Maria? He's in the pool. Please, please, get him! Call oh, you got me! Oh, you don't have to tell me. I know it. Cowboy. Oh, real good, real good. I can't complain. Yeah, well, I can see success stamped all over your hard head. <laughs> hey, you reckon that 20 bucks will be all right this week? Yeah, sure. Hey, I'll put it over the table somewhere. I bought Jody a present, that's why. What? I bought Jody a present, that's why. Well, that's good. You ought to do something smart. Marry that girl. Well, it won't be long now. I got a promotion. I'll be getting a raise. Is that right? Well, then I'll come to you for a loan. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Oh, Carl, honey, what a nice surprise. Don't make a bulldog break its chain. Ooh. How you doing, huh? Fine. What'd you buy this time? Paris, France? Oh, nothing. Just a little old dress. I'm gonna bathe. I'm totally exhausted. Well, we know how it is, don't we, Kyle? Sign all them credit cards and checks and wear you right out. You gonna fix something? Oh, yeah. Oh, Carl, can you stay for supper? Oh, no, thanks. Not tonight. Jody's cooking. As long as I live, baby, I'm gonna give. And you all of my heart. Can't be apart. As long as I live, yes, I'm gonna give. You stars above that shine. Just give me just a little more time Then I'm gonna make this whole world yours and mine Here you are, Dave. You got on for supper, huh? You'll see. Mmm. Warren, nobody makes chicken like you do. Nobody. I'm glad you like it, honey. I'll tell you, Joey, I can't see how you can take time to cook like this after working all day. Oh, no, you know I always find time to take care of my man. Let's go with the plant today. Well, I had a meeting with Bridges. And? We we'll discuss things. I told him how I felt. Well, that's good. Yeah, he agrees with me. He knows I can manage the men, how they all come to me and everything. They'll be lucky to get you. Because you're the greatest. Yeah. You are. to Mama today. She wants to know when we're gonna come visit. Jesus. I gotta go through that one again. Kyle, I think she knows about us. <laughs> Tell you what I know. <laughs> oh! Oh! I got 
something to tell you. I found a great apartment today. You got a great apartment. Oh, I know, honey. But this one is really special. And we can go look at it tomorrow afternoon. What do you say? Kyle! Stop that. Don't touch me again with it. Kyle, be serious. No, really, for one minute. Kyle! You almost got me! Stop! And it doesn't cost much more. And, <laughs> and I'll pay half the rent, okay? I told you after we're married, you ain't gonna work. <laughs> so I don't guess we're going dancing. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta go tonight. Come on, get dressed. Hurry up. Come on, move it. <laughs> Today it was the first time I laid eyes on you. I always remember. You walked through that door right over there with your girlfriend, and I knew right then and there I was in love with her. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I feel awful. I didn't get you nothing. You gave me the most wonderful year of my life. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Star. It's a beer bottle. Let's see. <laughs> Hold, it. Hold, Hold it up here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, I want it. Oh, you like it? I love it. It's beautiful. Kind of looks like a one, you know, for one year. So <laughs> nice. I just love it. Well, how about a kiss? <laughs> oh, I got a great big surprise. 
Let me tell you something, we're privileged to have with us here tonight one of our very own hometown girls who's done real well for herself. She's living out in Hollywood, California. She's a great big recording star on the L&M recording label. We're real proud of her. She stopped by to say hello. Let's have a big hand for our very own Caroline Peters. Again. Oh, it's been a long time. And this is what I've got to say about it. When I die, I may not go to heaven. I don't know if the cowboys in. If they don't, just let me go to Texas. Texas is as close as I've been. She held you tight Somebody must have loved you 
big mess, yeah, too. This is really nice, Jody. I like it. Well, we're going to get a new place soon, but it's OK for right now. These little rambunctious. <laughs> Can I get y'all something? Maybe a uh, beer? Yeah, I'd love a beer. Perrier would be great. I can get you a Lone Star or a Pearl, maybe Dr. Pepper. That's okay, anyway. Okay. I'll have a beer. Okay, What'd you say your name was again? Ransom Winthrop. You look exactly like you used to. You hadn't changed at all. Guy, it's so good to see you. Oh, I just can't believe you're here. Oh, I got your new record. Ransom produced it. Y'all want me to put it on? Maybe. Oh, no. <laughs> no, we've heard it. Hey, Caroline, you really know Waylon? Yeah. Ah, he's a good friend of mine. I've done shows with him and Willie. Caroline, why don't mean you... Let's go to the room and talk. Right? Yeah, sure. Let's go. So you live in L.A., huh? Beverly Hills. time ago when we were going to do all that stuff, you know? Like Jackie was going to be a, a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. <laughs> and me. And I was going to be a stewardess. And, and you and you were going to be a singer. And you are a singer. You're the only one that left and really did it. God, this is so great. Do you ever see Jackie anymore? No. She has two kids. And then her husband got shot in the motel with another woman. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I oh, know, that was really sad. Well, Jody, I'm glad to see you're happy. I mean, Kyle seems really nice. Oh, he's wonderful. And Ransom's not too bad himself. <laughs> hey, you old man. Come on now. Him? Come on. <laughs> oh. No. no, he just came down because we may cut some things on the road. You like watching TV? You don't play dominoes? Do you play backgammon? Uh-uh. Like to see my truck? No. Could I get you a pair of socks? How long have you and Kyle been together, anyway? Oh, one year tonight. Give me this. Let me see. You know, Jody, you're really lucky. Settle down in your own home, your own man, knowing where you're going to be the next day, next week, the next year. Yeah. What about California? California? Yeah, what's it like? It's different from out here, right? Well, from the day girls are born here in Texas, we're always taken care of. We're always looked after and protected because we're the only piece of property that a man has left to defend. I mean, a woman who needs space for herself gets out of Texas. It's a great place to be from, and it's a great place to come home to. But you gotta leave it first. Before it smothers you. Where are the ladies? Beats me. 
Hey, Jody. How y'all doing in there? So Oh, I'd love to. We got vacation time coming up pretty soon, so that ought to be fun. That'd be super. What you yelling about? We ain't being very nice, honey. We got company. I mean, it ain't every night we get to entertain a genuine, big-time Hollywood celebrity asshole. Friends, me and Austin here would rather get burned at the stake, let you get a bad buy at Richardson Covered Wagon Land. Right now, you can save hundreds, even thousands, in all makes and models of mobile homes. We have what you want in stock. And How many of them palaces you reckon you'll sell off that old commercial? Oh, I don't know. A couple of dozen or so this weekend. God damn. I could be using you in sales, Kyle. I got this deal in the wind coming up from Waco. Hell, I'm just waiting right now to hear from the banks. Oh, I don't know nothing about selling no mobile homes. Oh, hell, you didn't know nothing about oil rigs or construction or building fences, but you learned, didn't you? Yeah, while well, I can do that, I'm good with my hands. I'm good with your head, too, dumb butt. If you listen to me, I'll teach you how to make money with it. Yeah, I don't want to be no salesman, Rice. Oh, no, all I can change now. I'm only your brother, and I love you, and I'm just trying to help you out. Kyle. I know. Appreciate it. I know you do. I was meaning to tell you, you know, when I finish that commercial, that damn dumb vulture shit all over my tater mates. I guess he's just partial to you, Rice. Ain't they all? Now, remember that proposition I made you? I want you to think about it. I will. You give my best to Benny and the kids. I sure will. You give my best to Jody now. relationship with Jesus? Yes, Mama. Where's the salt and pepper? It's on the table. You know, people will fail you, but put your trust in Jesus and he'll never let you down. I know, Mama. Take half that butter out of there, honey. You've been taking good care of your body. I try. And believe me, Mama, I do everything I know how. Dear Lord, we thank thee for this food which you've given us for the nourishment of our bodies. Bless it to our use and us to thy service. Be with our loved ones and everything that they do. Help us to keep our bodies clean as a temple of God and a living witness to the power of Jesus. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 I know you and Kyle are living together. Loretta, what are you talking about? Why do you come up with this stuff in your head? Cut the bullshit, Jody. Who do you think's been keeping my mom from case? Does she know? No. Thanks. You're welcome. Coming into town. I'm gonna come spend a weekend with you. Okay. I knew you'd be happy to have me. Oh, boy. Jeez. There you go. There you go. Ten. Ten. How's the job coming along? Good. Real good. I'm in line for a promotion. Glad to hear it. Jody was saying. You know, sir, I really do want to take good care of Jody. We know you do. I hate it here. I hate it. How oh, they mean well. Just have patience with them. You don't know Jody. You just don't know what it's like. What are you talking about? I lived here myself, remember? Well, I'm 15 years old, and she still makes me go to Sunday school. Fuck! Loretta. I'm so bored. I can't wait to get the hell out of here and move to Dallas or Houston. That may not be far enough, babe. Oh, he's a hunk. <laughs> he's gonna be teen captain next year. So what does he like best about you? My boobs. Bye, Daddy. I love you. Bye, Jody. Thank you. Enjoy it. 
Thank you, sir. It's been a real fine afternoon, y'all. Come on, Lloyd. It's a pleasure, Kyle. Bye. Come on, Lloyd. Get in the car. out there but a bunch of salad heads. I just don't think I can stand living here much longer. Director assistance may help you. Truman Paint Hardware. Thank you. That's 555-4791. Jody, what y'all doing after work today? Looking for more apartments. What else? You seen this in the paper? They're interviewing today at the Marriott. You want come with me? And I just love people, you know. I love talking to them, and I love meeting them, and, and I, I think I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> so, you know, I mean, being a, a directory operator isn't much, but it can be rewarding at, at times. I just, I just wish the job had more to it. You know, it just gets the you know, same old routine all the time. But you like meeting new people. Oh yes, ma'am. I do. I, uh, I just love hearing what they have to say. I, I guess that's why I'd like to be a stewardess. You know. Meeting all those new people all the time and going all those places. Mm. Oh, I was going to be a stewardess one time. Oh, you didn't put that on your application. Mm, no, ma'am, but uh, a brand of accepted me. I just never could go. Why? Oh, well, my daddy died and um, and I had to stay at home. But uh... but now. Oh well, Mama remarried this real nice man, so she's. So you're prepared to move to Los Angeles for training? Oh, yes, ma'am. I, I just love to, to live and work in California. I just love to be a woman in California. You know what I need to do? I need to get laid. <laughs> Hard party, country, darling. I need some beef. Please, I just can't. Just settle down there. She can take you in a pool game. She can break them balls. She'll hustle up. two-legged taco. Ooh, she's hot to go. <laughs> nah, she's too pretty. <laughs> you finally fork it over and buy her the farm. Hard party country darling. Hard party country girl. How about that one over there, JB? <laughs> hey, Jelly Bob. You wouldn't really lay her now, would you? Well, it's a pig's rear pork. Sure is. <laughs> and you get the eggs, and I'll go get the bacon. <laughs> this is intolerable. <laughs> Fast. Uh, 
guess I can hold my own. Let's see how fast you really are. Show you how fast I am. <laughs> you can take him, Kyle. Come on, Kyle, you ain't got nothing to prove. Well? I promise, come on. I promise to never do it again. Don't worry, Jody. Kyle can handle himself. It's just so stupid, it's so dumb. I think it's exciting. I just wish the football season had come so all they do is sit around exchanging scores. Love circuit or what? We're competing for best rest. Is Caroline still here? I thought she left. Yeah, she did. I'll catch up with her in Tucson. What are they doing? They're gonna play cowboy. Draw! You get off on that kind of shit. I was bored with it a long time ago. What you need is a little coke, a little smoke, and me. I'll see you, Ransom. Do not forsake me, oh, my darling. <laughs> Make your move. me, Jody. I'm sick of you telling me what to do. You understand? Well, you can stay here and make a damn fool of yourself. I'm going home. You want to go home? You want? Go on. Go ahead. Go on home. I'll get your cab. Don't you want to go on? Hey, Jody. Jody. Hey, Jody. Don't be foolish. You don't want to be walking this time of night. I'll take you anywhere you want to go. Appreciate it. That's okay. Where you going? No place. Why don't you come with me? Tuesday, we catch up with Caroline in Tucson. Thursday, we'd be in Phoenix. You have a good time. You wouldn't get tired. You get him next time, my <laughs> pants. Don't worry about it. He had to beat hands down, Kyle, didn't he? He sure did. Like, Kyle, you had it. But come on, let's go get some breakfast. Oh, boy. you were what beautiful. Yeah, he was really beautiful. He got that last gulp, boy. Kyle? Think, Tiny just told me he saw Jody driving away in some fancy foreign car. Huh? Heading downtown.
those people, and they're just gonna live and die doing the same old thing. The idea of going someplace is going on down in the J.C. Penney parking lot and hanging out. <laughs> they never change. They never grow up. Yeah, Texas is a big place. I'll have to get out of. Yeah, well, I'm getting out. Where are you going? California. You ever been there before? No, I ain't never been no place except around here. Huh. We'll be in L.A. next week. I have a house on the beach, right on the ocean, near Linda Ronstadt. You know Linda Ronstadt? Are you kidding? We play frisbee on the beach all the time. Wow. Hey, what do you say you come with me to Tucson, huh? No strings attached, huh? You could stay with Caroline. No, I, I can't. I can't do that. Really. The whole world is in Texas. That truck. Move! Hair lift that son of a bitch. Let me mess up his... Let me mess up his hair. <laughs> Look, she wanted a ride. I didn't force her. She wanted to go for a ride. I mean, it was dark out. Hey, did you want to walk in? I was doing you a favor. <laughs> hey, look. I understand that you might not like where I'm coming from, but, hey, I don't go in for kidnapping chicks. I mean, that's just not my scene. Hey, what, what, I mean, what, come on, huh? <laughs> hey, what, what you want to do with him now, Kyle? <laughs> Hang him. Hey, come on, you got to be kidding me. You're joking, right? Hey, come on, Kyle. <laughs> yes. Hang him. For God's sake, you got to be <laughs> kidding me. <laughs> Tie him up! Tie him up! Tie him up! Leslie, hold that. Woo! Tie him up! Get 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 him up! I'm begging you. You stop that. Stop it now. Stop it, Kyle. Stop it. Kyle, listen to me. Now you listen to me. You're drunk. You're drunk. So long, Hollywood. Stop it. Well, I'll be damned if you didn't screw it up again. When in the hell are you going to learn how to tie a knot? <laughs> hey, uh, we didn't hurt you none, did we, cowboy? 
Well, y'all come on back to see us now, yeah? It's been real nice meeting you. I want you to know that. <laughs> Next time you're in these parts, you're always welcome. You know, you drop in. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed tonight's entertainment. And don't you forget to visit our snack bar now. So long. It's been good to know you. No! It's a dance of that song, Bob! So long! Kyle? 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 Kyle Richardson, you drunk! Look at me with every bite. Shifts. Oh, I don't mind. I could use the extra money. You know what we need to do? Is get into worm ranching. Sell them for bait. I'm not kidding you, Kyle. All we need is 350 bucks a piece, and we're ranchers. They reproduce themselves. I'm I serious. I ain't got 350 bucks, and if I did, I sure wouldn't invest in something that goes through life screwing itself. <laughs> See, you can do it. Let me give you some information now. One out of every 14 Texans live in Mobile Homes. Mobile Homes is Americans, little red school houses, and log cabins, Boys, Kyle. I ain't going to Waco to sell them damn things for you. Kyle, you do me a favor, will you? When you get home tonight, look at yourself and goddamn near, will you? <laughs> 
You look just like I did a few years ago, wasn't it? I used to hang out in them bars, put them quarters and them jukeboxes, playing cowboy, isn't that right, baby? <laughs> Remember how much you loved it? Yeah, hell yeah, sure. Everybody's got to throw a little party once in a while, but then you, you settle down and start taking on responsibilities. Jody, dear, you could wear nice clothes and quit that job answering the phone. Just take your place as a homemaker, supporting your husband after you get married. That's right, Mama. Life is important. To Harley and I just had it done. I'm sorry, baby. You always have it done. You remember how Daddy used to work me like a goddamn Mississippi nigger waxing them cars five dollars a day? Yeah. Yeah. You know what I did? I turned that used car lot into the biggest mobile dealership in three counties. What do you think Daddy'd think of that right now if he's alive? He'd be real proud of you, Royce. I'm sure he would. I am proud of me, Kyle. Come on, Jody, let's go. What's the matter, little brother? Don't you want to be a success? You know, I about had enough of you crawl over my back for one day. Poor shit. All I'm trying to do is help. I'm making you a proposition to make something of yourself for once. Royce, I don't want your help, OK? Over here, darling. Come on, hon, over here. Hey, Jody, hon, I thought it would be a nice idea to invite these good people so we could talk, don't you think? They're interested in your future, too. Come on, John, Lucille, your future son-in-law's got some good news for you. I tell you, that Gucci sister-in-law of yours ever says another word to me, I'm gonna deck her right upside the mouth. Yeah, they're the perfect couple, all right. Kyle, seems like a good opportunity. Your brother's a fine man. Oh, yes, sir, the very best. Jody, honey, can we give you a ride home to your apartment? Mama? Kyle, don't forget to thank your brother. Yeah, Mama. Well, kid, see you tomorrow. Have to come in. I was getting worried about you. Take a drive. You know, maybe I ought to go to work for that slob. Might even get rich like him. Some shitty Saturday night.
lady named Mary B. Porter used to hang around all the time, a little blonde gal? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. You know what I heard? I heard she had an operation, and she, now she's a man. Oh, hey, you. Oh, you know, I, I, you know, Wesley went to bed with her. Oh. No, I didn't. It wasn't me, it was Johnny Bob. I never touched her. <laughs> oh, Johnny Bob will fall in love with just about anything or anyone. You hear tell he once fell in love with a greyhound? Not the dog, the bus. Oh, <laughs> and where is old Johnny Bob anyway? Hell, the last I saw him, he was rolling across the water. <laughs> <laughs> no, he was, no, he was. I saw him leave with Tracy Joe. <laughs> <laughs> She's so ugly, if you looked up ugly in the dictionary, you'd find her picture. Oh, <laughs> that <ain't all. laughs> Who cares what they look like, as long as they got a hole between their legs. <laughs> You're disgusting. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? I think you can figure it out. You just ain't got no taste. You're crude, you're ugly, and you're gross. <laughs> got no right to talk to me like that, girl. Who the hell do you think you are, some princess? Huh? Mm -hmm. What do you get off talking to me hey, like that? Hey, come on, Dale. Bullshit, it, Kyle. Hey, she ain't got no goddamn it, right to easy. talk to me like that. You ain't got no right talking about Tracy Joe like that, either. And I'm tired of you categorizing women by their anatomy. You got that, buddy? That's enough, Jody. Oh, yeah, and something else I hear. I hear that your anatomy just don't measure up. Right? <sighs> way to go, Jody. Way to go. Well, I think this conversation just came to an end. Talking about uh, Johnny Bob. Hey, you know, I figured out something to do with old JB and that sawdust angel he is. Wait, 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 wait. You don't mean it, Kyle. You're damn straight. He's been asking for it. We're gonna give it to him. Oh, all right, let's do it then. All right. Hey, where are we going? Hey, get a ride home with Becky, will you? No, you take me home. Get a ride home. I was at home. Should have stayed there. Yeah, maybe you should have. Hey, come on, Whistle Dick, let's go. Yeah! Every Saturday night, they have to do something memorable. You know, something to make them feel real important, like big men, you know? God, I've had enough of it. Hey, what are you doing? Texas Rangers, ma'am. Making a pornography bust. I think you better get back inside. Thank you for cooperation. Coffee? You live here? Is this yours? Shh. 
She's gonna wake up in the damn worms. Move this off the highway. Oh, what's all the commotion? I mean, right now. I'm up. Is that the way I taught you to live? I'm asking you a question. No, Mama. You gave your heart to Jesus when you were nine years old. Now look at you. Mama, I do love Jesus. But I'm not nine years old anymore. I go to work and I'm a grown woman. And I'm living my life for me, Jody Lynn Palmer. That's who I'm living my life for. And I love Kyle. I love Kyle, and he loves me, Mama. And that's not a sin. That's something very special, Mama, and you're just gonna have to understand that. That you understand. Kyle, I gotta talk to you. All right, I'm listening. Well, put on a magazine. Come on, are you gonna put on a magazine so I can talk to you? Okay, go ahead. Uh, you know, I got accepted as an airline stewardess. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Well, they want me to come to Los Angeles for training. I mean, California's a terrific place for you, too, babe. I mean, they got a lot of high-paying jobs, and with your skills, you won't have any trouble at all. I ain't gonna leave Texas, never. Neither are you. Tell me, you just take a look out that window right there. That ain't White Earp and Doc Holliday walking down the street anymore. That's Colwell Banker and Exxon and Kentucky Fried Chicken, and there ain't hardly anything left of Texas anymore. What's the matter with you, Jody? You want to leave me? You don't love me anymore? Oh, Kyle. Kyle, you know I love you. And it's because I love you I want us to get out of here. Because we got our whole lives ahead of us. And if we stay, we're just going to rot. That's all. I just want you to understand, babe. Suppose I went to Waco and worked for my brother. Well, that'd be a step, Kyle, but I, I don't... I don't want you to do anything that'll make you unhappy, and then it's just... Ah, screw it. I'll give him a call. Mm. Now we got that settled, let's go celebrate. Kyle, I'm not going to stay in tonight. So do you got your period or what? Well, I just don't want to go. I'd rather stay here and read or something. Honest to God, Jody, I don't know what your problem is. I think you've been reading that Ms. Magazine too much. Kyle, I'm not going to the stallion anymore. Well, I am. Well, fine, then go. I will.
You go on home and get some sleep. I'm gonna stay here. No. I'm gonna stay with you. You're late. Where's that other jack off? You ain't coming in. Get to work. Get back to work. I want to buy my promotion. When am I going to get it? You're not. Why not? Because I don't like you, that's why. Now get back to work. be too long. No more than five minutes. Rest of my life? Well, hell, all cowboys limp. Get out of here, Kyle. Go on. Leave me alone. Texas, one in 14 people live in a mobile home. A new build house in Texas will cost you uh, all kinds of money. But you can purchase a manufactured home like this one here for $36,000. A mobile home is the answer. Uh, what about property tax? You pay for them. Property tax. Well, I. I suppose, sir, that would depend on the size of uh, your home and the amount of property that you have. But you can rent a lot in Chaparral Village for only $25 a month. 
And that way, Thank when you, you move, you can take your home with you. We's just looking. My, my name is uh, Kyle. We'll even throw in a welcome mat with your initials on it. Initials? Initials. Mm -hmm. Wonderful, yeah. Yes, a mobile home is the answer. <laughs> Yeah. Come on in. Uh, hope I'm not interrupting anything. Uh, no, darling. Kyle's out front. Yeah, I know. I, I wanted to come in and talk to you for a minute if I could. Oh, well, come on in. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. How you doing, darling? Look pretty. Uh, Take that jacket for you? Yes. Yeah. Beautiful hair. Sit down there, huh? Make yourself comfortable. Yeah, I, uh... You don't drink? Uh, turkey, coat, would be fine. All right. Turkey and coat. You got it. Is that your usual? Oh, well, sometimes, yeah. <laughs> yep. I'll tell you, I used to drink it. Then I'd wake up in the morning walking sideways like a damn spider, so I switched. <laughs> You want some ice in there? Yeah, a couple pieces, please. All right. Nice surprise. Now tell me, what can I do you for? Well, I come to talk about Kyle. Yeah? Well, what about him? Well, Royce, you know what I really think Kyle needs is, is just to move to another state. Whoa, whoa, Nellie. Tell you one thing, and that ain't two. There ain't no other state but Texas. Well, I know that. Well. But I just don't think he's gonna be too happy selling these mobile homes. It's just not. He probably won't be. He'll probably hate it. What's the difference? We all hate it. My salesman hate it. I hate it. It's a whore's game, and you're in it for the pay. But all this time, you've been telling Kyle to come on into business with you. Why? Just so he can be as unhappy as you are? Yeah. Why not? Because he's your brother, and you're supposed to love him. Let me tell you something, darling. Kyle's a big boy, and Kyle can take care of himself. Your number one worry is Jody. You take care of Jody. Yeah, well, Jody can take care of herself, too. I'm sure she can. I bet she can just about get anything she wants. Yeah, well, Roy, you know, you got you got a real nice wife now, and, I and, I, and, yeah, and, and three fine kids. I, I really like them. No, I do like them, but I came here to talk about Kyle. I know. Come here. So I'm. Come here. No, to, I'm. Listen to me. Listen to me now. Come on, Royce, now. This ain't. Come on. This ain't funny. It's not. You'll always be a fucker. It's not funny, isn't it? Let me go! Oh, for God's sakes! Oh, no! No! Come on. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stop! Stop! Oh, Stop it! Bitch! No, it's not what you think, Kyle. How the hell are you? You said anything yet? <laughs>
Come. We finish it. Ah, sir. I never said no before I didn't know how I've never said that Before now I guess I could tell and away we'd fly together just you and I I've never been kissed before I do. When you live with somebody, do you screw every night? I read them. There's more to a relationship than just sex. So if you love Kyle and Kyle loves you, why'd you break up? Because sometimes staying together just don't work out. People grow in different directions. Don't mean you don't love each other. You just change. I tried. I tried to make Kyle understand, but I just couldn't. Committing suicide over, huh?
You don't sleep so good. You talk a lot. So do you. I know. He could have called. At least. Yeah. He's probably just screwing another girl, son of a bitch. A lot of help you are. Love you, Mama. Bye, honey. Mm. Take care. Right. I will. And don't cry. Everything will be all right. Remember, Jesus is sending you to serve as witness where he needs you most. I know. I'll miss you, honey. So long, hot pants. <laughs> Jody. It's going to be so different without you. Oh, come on, kid. You can come see me. Can I really? Yeah. Come here. Something I want you to do for me. Okay. How about taking care of my car? <laughs> yeah! Oh, Jody, I can't believe it. Yeah, don't, don't mess me up now. Oh, Jody. You gotta wash that loose muffler. I don't want to worry about you getting them tickets, you know. Got to go, Jody. Okay, Daddy. Now, take care of yourself. Afternoon, ma'am. Yes. Could I talk with Jody, please? No, you can't. Well, it's very important I talk with her. Jody ain't here. Well, the car's here. Where'd she go? Airport. Airport? When? Half hour ago. Ma'am, I know how you feel. I do, but please, you've got to tell me. What plane is she catching? Shuttle to Dallas. Flight 43, 1 o'clock. Hurry, Kyle. Thank you, Loretta. You're welcome. You know I just can't stand to hear the 
Cause you suddenly need to have to bang back line Cause if you leave me, darling, you know you're gonna break my mind Break my mind Where do I find the one o'clock plane to LA? Oh, in just a minute. I'm got a minute. Where is it? It's gate three. Excuse me. woman and you're coming with me. We'll get to California, I'll get a good job, we can get married, and you won't even have to be a stewardess. Can I not you understand anything? Oh. Look, honey, I'm sorry for how I acted. I admit I was dumb and stupid and jealous. But you know I didn't mean nothing by it, and I'll make it up to you. So come on, baby, let's go. Forget you, baby. You didn't trust me. You didn't believe me. So I bought some clothes and I made some plants, because I mean something. And what I want means something. After I cried my heart out, you show up after all the shit you put me through. Well, forget it, Cal, because I got an airplane ticket and you don't. And just go home, Cal, and get out of my life and leave me alone. Go pull some dipshit cowgirl out of that honky-tonk, because I'm going to L.A. to be a stewardess. And make something out of my goddamn life, and if you think I'm not just to stay with you, well, forget it, Cal Richardson, I don't need you. Hey, Jody! Sir, I'm sorry. I must see a boarding pass. I'm just going to show the lady to her seat. I'm sorry. But... I'm, I'm sorry. She's right there. I'll only be one second. I'm sorry? No. Hey! Jody, don't go! Don't go! Jody, don't go! Jody, I need you. You're all in the world that matters to me. Please don't go. Please, sir, you must leave. Jody, you can be a stewardess, you can be a movie star, you can be whatever the hell you want. I won't say a word. It's just us, as long as we're together. This Texas, Man, California, officer. it don't okay, matter. Bubba. As long as let's we're go. together, just us. Get a minute. Go now. Come on, come on. Get a minute. Let's go. Hey, hey buddy. Get a minute. You get a minute. Damn it, you come back here. Hey, Jody, Jody, please, listen to me. Don't do this to me. Yeah. Ah. 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 Leave him alone. Look at you. Jody, don't get on that plane. Does it hurt? Everything I have hurts. Every part of me. Jesus, Kyle. Jody, come with me to California. Tell me you will. Of course I will. Of course I will. They're going together. I've got a sister in Anaheim. Well, you're going to be a stewardess. And I'm going to be with you. I love you. God, I love you. So crazy, lady, let's don't stay. Forget about the last frontier. This is her country out here. This is her. So don't 
This is hard.